I-27 male, took a loan from my dad, 63 male, about seven years ago for my college studies. He had offered the option when I told him I was going to take some time off before going to college to get the money. He also told me that my older brother, 30, had taken the same deal, and it worked out great for him. I figured that it would help me a lot to stay on track with my goal to become an engineer. He gave me the loan at a rate slightly higher than what other banks or financial institutions would offer. I didn't know that at the time though. He also told me that I had more time to pay it back since he wasn't going to be breathing down my neck over it. And I could start paying back whenever I started working. Having all the money at once would certainly save me from diverting my attention from my studies. So I agreed and took the loan. I finished my school in good time and landed a good job. So, I approached my dad about the repayment. I tried to renegotiate the terms, since I found out that I would be paying more than I would have with the bank. I also learned that my older brother had gotten his loan with more favorable terms that my dad didn't extend to me. When I brought all that up, my dad didn't budge. He said I had agreed to whatever I had agreed to, and it was my fault for not doing my due diligence ahead of time. Then, he insisted on getting his money paid in full within two years. He clearly forgot that he said he wouldn't box me in. Anyway, I tried to talk to mom about it because I thought she didn't know what was going on and it would help to have someone else see the absurdity of the deal. She sided with my dad and told me there was no way to change my dad's mind. Rather than drag this out, she told me to just pay it off since I was earning some good money. I made drastic changes to my lifestyle to pay it up though. I got a small apartment with roommates forfeited buying a car and all those other things my colleagues were getting too. Luckily enough, I paid it up within his time frame and let it go. It definitely strained some things in our relationship, but at least I got to move on and didn't have it hanging over my head. Despite that repayment setback, I was able to work my ass off for a promotion and make some sound investments to put me in a comfortable financial position. Now, I'm planning a wedding and haven't asked my parents for help. I figured that they might come up with tighter strings tied to their money. So I've been moving things forward on my own and while they know that I'm planning a wedding, they also haven't offered to do anything. The most insane bit of this is that my dad recently came over and told me he wanted to buy property as part of his retirement plan. Someone had approached him with a deal too good for him to pass up on, but he didn't have that money ready. So he asked me for help since I'm doing better than my brother on that front. I guess he simply expected me to give him the money because he lost it when I told him that I could give him a loan. I even cited a higher interest rate than the bank or what he gave me. He was pissed. He said that I couldn't do that to family. Apparently, families should be able to rely on each other with no strings attached and that it amounted to extortion. I pointed out that he did the same thing to me and my interest rate was only slightly higher than what he had asked of me. He didn't want to hear that. Instead, he started telling me how he had looked after me since I was a child and he had never asked for anything in return. I told him that those were his responsibilities as a parent and he shouldn't have been expecting anything in return. Then he went on to say that I was enjoying a comfortable position because of him. If he hadn't given me the loan when he had, I wouldn't be where I am. He also added that he had been just teaching me responsibility all along. I agreed that he helped with my studies, but I told him that I had worked hard for my promotion and been wise with my investments. He couldn't take that away from me. I also added that I was planning a wedding, something you should have remembered and needed all the money anyway. My dad scoffed it off and said I could do a simple court wedding and save the rest. I told him that it was my money and I could do what I pleased with it. He wasn't on board with that thought and stormed out. Now, my dad is threatening to disown me. My mom has been calling since then, telling me to reconsider. Am I the a-hole? Sometimes what goes around comes around. Update. I feel comforted by most of the messages I've read on this platform. My father didn't want a taste of his own medicine and I think I'm fine with it. He didn't take the loan and I haven't heard from him since he stormed out. My mom is now acting as the go-between. I found out that someone else bought the property from under them before they had the chance to get all the money together. This added salt to the wound my father was already nursing. I don't expect that we will be friendly with each other anytime soon. I'm also not sure if they will show up for my wedding since my father sees it as a waste of money in the first place. I sent them the invitations all the same. 
I hope he eventually realizes that he needs to treat family better than he has. I'm 27 male and my sister is 26. For the most part, I would say we get along pretty well and haven't had a fight since we were like 20 and 19. I let my sister and her boyfriend stay at my place for the time being because they are new to the city and since I lived there, I decided to be a good brother and give them a place to stay. They paid rent but I made sure it was pretty cheap because I wanted to do them a favor. They pretty much do their own thing and I don't see them much, but about once or twice a week, we all sit down and watch a TV show or movie together. I live with my girlfriend so I'm not the third wheel, lol. But on a commercial, it was talking about the gym or something, and my sister got all miffed that they were saying stuff like being fat is bad. A bit of backstory, she isn't fat by any means. Her fiancé is a little chubby but I would say he's more stocky than actually chubby. I'm a bit stocky too, from what people have told me. When we were teens, she was pretty mean to me about being fat. I'll admit back then I was pretty fat but after high school, I wanted to lose weight and get in shape and my sister was my biggest supporter. But recently she's really into that body positivity and I think her boyfriend is into that too. I really thought he knew about her teasing me because of my weight as a kid. I hold no grudge over what she said to me as a teen because I know she regrets it now and we're good. But when she said that, I kind of smirked and jokingly said something like, Why couldn't you be so body positive when I was fat? You hated me as kids because of that. I started laughing hoping that she would join in, but I got nothing but a glare from her and a boyfriend looking pretty shocked at what he heard. He then got up and left the scene. My sister called me a dumbass and went with him. I didn't think anything of it. I heard some screaming and arguing coming from their room, but I had the couch with my girlfriend, so I just blocked that out. The next day, they are super tense around each other, and I feel kind of bad. My sister is kind of pissed at me and said I should have just kept my mouth shut, while her boyfriend is saying I did the right thing by saying that. I do feel bad that I caused the fight, but I think both of them are being very overdramatic about this. Am I the a-hole for telling a joke that caused a big fight between my sister and a boyfriend?